Country Club Properties, Real Estate for Country Clubs, Three New Country Club Listings as of 070519. Today we're going to feature three new Country Club listings and it is July 5th, 2019. I'm going to use our website, which is countryclub.properties, and we're going to check out three of the newest listings. They feed in automatically, and we're going to check them out and profile them. But first, before we get started, hi, this is Jeff Buck from Club Properties, just reminding you to always use a realtor and a real estate attorney before making any financial decisions. This show is for entertainment purposes only. Thank you. I want to remind you that this is for entertainment, and we're just going to go through here and check it out. So this is for fun. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go over to countryclub.properties. And on here, we're gonna check out, this This feeds in all the newest listings this week or, or the next, in the last couple of days. So you can find them uh, right here in this grid pattern and it'll show you what's new. So if, if I click on this website, I can scroll over and it's gonna give me an idea of what community they're in, what development, what city and the price range. So a lot of people like to obviously go by price range. So in this instance, we're gonna check out uh, three properties that I have listed for you already, which is one that's 4.5 million and that's in Pelican Bay in Naples, Florida. So let's check that out. And then we're gonna look at the sanctuary in San on Sanibel Island, which is a super nice place to, to live. And then we're gonna go and check out a less expensive, but just as cool listing at Talis Park. And we're gonna check out the country clubs and a little information about the listings and the membership opportunities for you. So the first listing we're gonna look at is a three bedroom, three bath in Naples, Collier County. And it's in the development of Pelican Bay and it's in the Remington at Bay Colony, built in 1996. Uh, last year's taxes were $14,416 and that's for the 2017 tax year. It has a two car garage, it's unfurnished, pets are allowed but there's limits. And we're gonna go on down, we're gonna check out, it's got a ton of nice interior features. I'm gonna go to the financial information, uh, master HOA fees are $2,460, uh, HOA fees are $3,551, HOA frequency is annually, and there's a condo fee of $24,308, I'm guessing annually as well. Uh, that's what it says, annually. So it has some school information here, building design, it's a high rise, uh, eight floors or more, and it's gated and it's in the Pelican Bay area. It's 3,560 square foot, 22 total uh, floors with a Western exposure. Um, it's not a foreclosure or a short sale. It comes with two garage spaces, general basic electric, and, and all the utilities are included. Um, amenities are barbecue, picnic, beach area, beach club available, biking, jogging path, business center, community pool, community room, hot tub, exercise room, pretty much all kinds of goodies here. And it's got golf frontage and it's on the Gulf Beach. And where on the Gulf Beach? Well, it's in Naples, Florida, which is in Florida, obviously. And we're going to just zoom out and we're going to take kind of a look at it. And in perspective to the rest of Florida, you're down south, southwest Florida. So you're around this area right here, okay? Now, if we look, there's a club at the Club Pelican Bay, and this is a country club that they have, which looks, looks really nice. Um, golf, spa, fitness, all the kinds of things you want. There's a, a brochure you can download to learn everything about the club. Um, there's an exercise room, there's a contact form, you can get in touch with them. And then here is some membership information. There are 27 holes of Champion Golf, designed by Arthur Hills. Um, it's got dining, Oaks Room, Oaks Terrace. There is um, a bunch of information on different types of memberships you can have. And then there's a membership brochure that you can get and you can just kind of click through and check it all out on your own, okay? And we'll link to this to at countryclub.properties. Country You'll be able to find it there. Alrighty, the next listing we're gonna look at is in the sanctuary, sanctuary at Wolfert, Wolfert, W-L-F-E-R-T. This is on Sanibel Island. It's a four bedroom, six bathroom, partial three bath, 
It's in Lee County. It's considered a single family. Let's look at some of these pictures. Wow. Pretty nice. Uh, ooh, look at that pool area. That's nice. So it's an architectural masterpiece which elicits all kinds of refined island living, resting on two lots with the island's premier location on the sanctuary. And upon approach, you're greeted by a uh, stone drive along with elaborate slate facade, exceptional architectural details encompass the property. Okay, so there's a bunch of more information here. You can read about this property. It looks like a really nice place. Um, it's a split level, single family. It's a golf course community type. It's got uh, 13,438 square foot feet. And it is on uh, it's two floors. It's a southeast exposure. Uh, it's concrete block. It's not a foreclosure or, sh or short sale. It looks like it's been on the market for four days. Three garage spaces, marble wood floors. It's got a tile roof, central electric, pets, no approval needed as well as HOA fees are zero. Okay, and so if we check out where this is on the map, I'm just going to minimize this and kind of zoom out, give you an idea. Uh, Sanibel Island is off the coast. Uh, it's on the Gulf of Mexico. So there's Fort Myers, Cape Coral, and Naples is south, and this is I-75. So if you're coming on down I-75 from say Tampa, or you could come across I-75 from South Florida. All right, and then as far as the rest of the country goes, this is about how far it is down south in Florida, okay? So the sanctuary has a golf club and it looks pretty nice. I gotta say, I'd love to be there. Dining and social, golf memberships, um, tennis, um, all kinds of great wildlife uh, events and tons more stuff available for you so if we want to contact those folks we can just go on their website and get the membership information and see what type of memberships they offer this is off they're offering an equity membership so it's their premier offering it, it includes all it includes access to all the club facilities freshly remodeled and renovated in summer of 2016 a par 72 champion arthur hills design golf course driving range short game range putting area chipping area golf lessons priority tee times and tournament play it's got a 50,000 square foot clubhouse world-class dining four hard true tennis courts pickleball courts 5,000 square foot wellness center with a sports pool and a bunch of other amenities. Looks like a really fabulous place to live, so you can check that out. All right, and then the next listing we're gonna look at is in Tallis Park. And this is for 9,000, or 989,000. I'm sorry, I'm gonna go back. The previous listing that we looked at was 3.195 million, and the first listing that we looked at was 4.5. So we have 4.5, 3.195 and now we're down to $989,000. We're going to check this one out, see a few of the pictures of it. Um, this is in Naples. It's a three bedroom, three bath in the sub subdivision of Carrera. And last year's taxes were $9,513. That was for 2018. It has a 2000, I mean, it has a two car garage attached or a two car garage attached, which is nice. Um, some really nice bedrooms, great views of the outside. And this is kind of what the, the building looks like. These are what the, the overall area looks like. Here's the buildings along the road. And it, I guess it's pretty much maintenance free living. We're gonna go all the way back. Okay, so imagine the elevator opening to your very own private foyer. With 2,900 square feet under air, three bedrooms and a den, three and a half, three and a half baths, you can walk through the French doors to an open floor plan featuring a great room, a dining area, and a gourmet kitchen. Okay, it's over fifty thousand dollars in upgrades, KitchenAid stainless steel. It's, it's it's got a lot of great features. You can read more about it on CountryClub.properties. Uh, 9,513 in taxes in 2008. HOA master fees are 323. Um, HOA fees are zero. HOA description is mandatory. Condo fee is $2,810, and that's quarterly. 
Uh, you can check out the schools. It's been different. It's, this is an end unit in the building that's four to seven floors. Okay. And we're going to check out where this is in relation to the rest of, of the properties. So I'm going to zoom out and we're going to look at, this is I-75 right here. And as we said before, you go down, down south to Florida, uh, to, to Fort Lauderdale in Miami, or you go up to Tampa, St. Petersburg, Clearwater, and in relation to the rest of Florida, here we go. So I'm gonna zoom back in, and what's great about this property is it's, it's convenient to the interstate. And if we go to the, if we go right here, you can, you can get right on, um, right on the interstate right over here. So it's really easy, nice, nice place to go. So we're going to look at this place and see what kind of country club they have. Here's the, the club itself. Um, they got, uh, talk this, their country club site will tell you what some of the residents are going to say about it and how they feel. Um, and it'll give you a little tour of the park. And then if we go over here, we can check out our membership. There's a resident golf member, resident sport membership, and a non-resident golf membership. So you can get more information here on this club and you can make a decision. So what's it gonna be, folks? Are you gonna, you gonna go for the 989,000, just under a million, somewhere between three, just over three, or are you gonna shoot for 4.5? I was just going to wrap up with some pictures of the tower here because I don't think I showed them to you earlier. Just going to go through nice hallway, nature walk, out to the Gulf of Mexico. It's kind of cool, a nice pool, jacuzzi, outside dining area, deck overlooking the Gulf of Mexico, it looks like. Beautiful views. We're going to go back. Okay. So we've, we profiled Pelican Bay in Naples, Florida, Collier County. We previewed the sanctuary out on Sanibel Island. And then we previewed um, Talus Park, which is also in Naples. So we're gonna come back here and I'm just gonna say, um, I'm just gonna say, this Southwest Florida area has a ton of great properties to look at with this website, countryclub.properties. You can sign up for email property updates. You can get alerts anytime something new happens. And let's say you find something you like or you want to know more about the property. What we will do is we'll connect you with one of our great realtor partners that focuses in on your community. We have the ability to pull out reports. We can see who the top agents are in any community. Uh, we know most of them. We've been doing this for over 17 years in the market. So what we'll do is we'll put you in touch with the best agent in that development, subdivision, country club that you want. And we'll try and help make a good connection so you can get the property that you want. I'm gonna play our disclaimer one more time. But if you'd like any more information, you can fill out the contact form, send us an email. We can put you in touch with some great membership directors that you can find out more information on clubs that you might like, or you can get more information on properties that come on the market. At countryclub.properties, the front grid pattern page is always feeding in the latest country club properties. And so we, we appreciate your time. And thank you so much for Hi, this is Jeff Buck from Club Properties, just reminding you to always use a realtor and a real estate attorney before making any financial decisions. This show is for entertainment purposes only. Thank you.